five famous guns of the Old West. Number five, Smith & Wesson model number two, found on the body of Wild Bill Hickok after he was murdered by 24-year-old Jack McCall at a saloon in Deadwood, South Dakota. The sheriff of Deadwood gave the pistol to the Willow family to pay an outstanding debt owed by Hickok. In 1972, it was given to the Zymetsky family, who still owns the gun today. Valued at three dollars to $500,000, the pistol was put up for auction in 2013, failing to meet its reserve. Number 4. The 1873 Colt Single Action Army, owned by Billy the Kid. Estimated to be worth up to $500,000, the only gun on this list that's considered lost. Its last known location was somewhere in southern Alabama. Shown here in the only known photo of the kid, it will probably remain lost. Number 3. This 1851 Colt Navy is the second gun on the list belonging to an outlaw, the infamous Jesse James. The leader of the James Younger Gang, seen by most as a Western Robin Hood, James's crimes caught up to him in the spring of 1882 when he was betrayed by fellow gang member Robert Ford. The cult now resides at the Fraser History Museum in Louisville, Kentucky. Number 2 This Remington New Model Army was owned by soldier, scout, slash showman, and all-around tough guy, Buffalo Bill Cody. This revolver accompanied Buffalo Bill in 19 documented battles. Cody is quoted saying, I carried it for many years in the Indian Wars and Buffalo killings, and it never failed me. The pistol now resides in a private collection after being put up for auction in 2012. Number 1 The second peacemaker in our list, it belonged to the most famous lawman in U.S. history, Wyatt Earp. This Colt single action army sold at auction in 2014 for the sum of $225,000. The controversial lawman's pistol now resides in private hands. Well, that's the end of this list. If you enjoyed watching, shoot that like button and subscribe, and I'll catch you next time.